Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be talking about free brushes for Procreate that you can instantly download on your iPad and you can instantly import to your Procreate app. Now, I am at this website called Brushes for Procreate. Now, they have a huge number of paid and free brushes. So what I did was I just went through all of them, the free ones, and I came up with nine brushes which are amazing and which I highly recommend you guys downloading as a beginner. Or even if you're not a beginner, I think these brushes are going to help you. So without further ado, let's just jump right into the video. Okay, so what we are going to do is we are going to go through each and every brush set on this list and then we will jump on to the Procreate app just to see how these brushes work. So the first one on this list is this called the Skin Brushes for Procreate and this is by Tyro Zipai, if that's how you call the name. So these are some skin detailing brushes and I really liked them so what you can do is you can either download each and every brush or selected brushes from the set separately as you can see here or you can just download the full brush set so that's what I did I just downloaded it, downloaded the full brush set so the next one on this list is this brush set called eyebrows pack now these are some eyebrow stamp kind of brush set which you can download for free and this is by the artist i think the name is cherry bell and these brushes are completely free so you're getting eight eyebrow stamp brushes and these eyebrows look amazing so if you are someone who struggles with making eyebrows then you can just go ahead and download these and yeah they are completely free and I'm also thinking to create my own brush set, own eyebrow stamp brush set. I have a lot of eyebrows that I made, which I think I'm gonna upload as brush set soon. I'll let you guys know. So yeah, that's that. Okay, so the next one on this list is this brush set called Iris Brush Set. Now this is also by Cherry Bell. So these are some stamp brushes for Iris. So yeah, that is quite amazing and these are completely free as well. So yeah, let's just move on to next. Okay, so the next one on this list is this brush set called Free Lighting Brush Pack and I really like this because I personally like using some sort of lighting in my artwork. Now this brush set is by Atki, if that's how you call the name. And this brush set is completely free and you are going to get six free brushes. And I will link everything down in the description. Now the next one on this list is this brush set called... There's no name as such but these brushes are for skin texture. And you are going to get 20 free brushes for that. And yeah, that is why I really liked it because... I was I was struggling when I in the beginning when I was painting portraits because I was not really getting the texture that I really wanted on the skin but I think this this whole brush set is going to help a lot of people so really appreciate appreciate the artist even though there's no name so if you know who's the owner of this brush set then you can just comment their name down in the comment section below and yeah so that is quite amazing let's just move on to next now the next one is watercolor brush set and these are completely free these are by Stony, and yeah as you can see those brushes do look like the ones um, when you do on paper if that makes any sense so that is why i decided to keep this in my list so yeah again these brushes are free so you just have to click the download full brush set right here and you are good to go and i will be showing you how to import all of these brushes in procreate so don't worry about that now next brush set is it is called interior brushes and these are some textures that texture brushes that you can use for 
you know if you are making some sort of house or some sort of interior design then you can use these brushes these texture brushes I really like them and they are free as well and these are by sketch all art okay so the next one is this brush called oil pastel canvas brush and this is not a brush set you are only gonna get one brush but yeah this brush is amazing because of the texture that you're getting out of this brush is like oil pastel so and again this brush is completely free and this brush is by MD artwork six okay so the last one which is one of my favorite one is big eyelashes brush set by Tayo Zipai now correct me if I am saying that name wrong so you are actually getting twin sorry 17 total brushes in the brush set and again you can either download each brush separately or you can just download the full brush set okay so now I'm just going to show you how to download and import the brushes on your procreate app now what you want to do is you want to click the download button right here and once you have done that the brushes are going to start downloading and then once you are done with the downloading you just hit this icon right here this download icon right here and then you just click onto the brush like this and it will automatically import the brush onto your procreate app so let's just go ahead and see how the brushes work so I'm going to be keeping it really simple and quick and I'm just going to be going over every brushes and I'm just going to show you how they are working. So the first one we are going to be testing out or checking out is the eyelash brush set. Now let's just select one of these. I really like this one. As you can see they look amazing. These are stem brushes, but if you want to create some sort of texture, you can go ahead and do this. Looks like fur for some reason. So yeah. This brush set also have some bottom lashes. I'm going to be using a lot. I'm just going to be using this brush set a lot. I know for sure. As you can see, the eyelashes are amazing. I think this one is my favorite. So yeah, that's that. Now just check out the interior, the texture, the wall-like texture, the wooden texture that I just showed you in the list. So I'm just going to be testing out this one. just gonna take a wooden kind of color and I'm also gonna be increasing the size as well and I really love this I love this I don't really like I don't really like the ones the procreate has by default I think this looks kind of realistic as well as you can see I'm it is just getting darker and darker as I'm I'm going over it I love this I just try some other texture brush so I'm gonna be checking out this one this one also looks good you can use this one for tree branches or something like that I just try some other as well maybe mm, this one I don't know if I tried this one initially I kind of forgot so yeah that that was it for the texture ones I liked it I'm just gonna give it five stars not just tries Tony's watercolors so now I'm just gonna be taking a color really light and bright color let's try it out and just gonna increase the size and opacity of it 
And here you have it. Let's just try some other color just over this, just to see how well it is mixing. So yeah, it is kind. Of, it does feel like we are kind of painting on paper. And the brushes are amazing. So these are the skin texture kind of brushes, and yeah, let's just try out this one called Skin Texture, and then just I'm just gonna be picking up a skin kind of color like that and increase the size of the brush as well yeah I like this so this is the skin texture brush let's just try some other brush as well so I'm gonna try splatter And this is also a good brush you can either use it for freckles or you can either use it just to create some more texture into the skin now let's just try out freckles as well okay this is also amazing so yeah that's that and let's just go ahead and check out free shine so for that what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna change the background color so that we can really see how the light is going so i'm just gonna select this color just dark maybe this color or maybe this one and then i'm just gonna check the second one right here and a yellow color maybe yeah this looks amazing you guys this lighting is amazing i really like it so the next one that we are going to be trying out is the brush set called iris by cherry bell and i'm using a blue color right here so let's just try them out so i'm going to be trying out the fourth one and as you can see they look amazing so I don't think that this brush stamp would do the work alone you'll have to go ahead and put some details in to make it more realistic and the way you like it but I still think this brush is amazing to use now let's just check out skin details 2.0 by Tayo Tayo I forgot I forgot the name I'm sorry now these are some glitter like freckles like kind of brushes texture brushes that you can use on your portrait drawings so i'm just going to be checking out cute glitter first and i'm going to be choosing this brown kind of color and as you can see cute as you can see the word cute written over the texture actually this is cute you can use this on your portraits to make it look cute or you can just use it as background to add something to it yeah that is nice that is amazing let's just try out some other brush so i'm gonna be trying out devil glitter as you can see this is amazing as well you can again you can use it use it for your background or just on anything that you like this is quite amazing and really cute let's just try out peach glitter this is cute as well i mean you can create a good background with a good color so if i go ahead and choose a pink color See, you can create a good really good really cute background with these brushes as well so I like it I think this brush set is gonna be my favorite one now let's just check out eyebrows by cherry bell again and these are some eyebrow stamps so I'm gonna check out this one first and I'm gonna be taking a black color to check this out so as you can see these eyebrows look amazing so i'm gonna check each and every one of them like that and first one 
as you can see so if you struggle with making eyebrows I think this is gonna be really helpful for you guys these stamp brushes are gonna be really helpful for you guys I'm just gonna try out the last one as well not the last one but the second one I'm just gonna decrease the size of it just so we can see and here's the brush and yeah I think this is amazing and this is uh, quite helpful for people who really struggle with making eyebrows now what I'm thinking right now is I I also want to create my own eyebrow brushes and brush stamp but let's just check out first the last brush set as well which is the oil pastel canvas brush now as as I told you guys here is only one brush for this brush set which is oil pastel canvas brush so I'm just gonna show you the how the texture looks like here you can see the texture almost looks like the texture we uh, get on the paper so that is why I really liked this brush now you can use the same brush as your smudging brush as well so guys that wraps up today's video I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video and found it helpful and I will link all the links down in the description and if you did like my video please do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys the next time